Good morning guys, you are back with Southern Urbex. We've come to an old RAF base here, right in the middle of Cheshire. But I thought I'd take a drive out. I've seen this one on the net as well. This has been recorded a good couple of years ago. And it's right off the beaten track. So it's took me a bit to get to this guys, but I just thought I'd quickly show you around, see what's here, what's left of it. As you can see, I think I'm saying this is right. This is RAF Cliff Valley. This is what's left of a former RAF base. A couple of older buildings as well. Not sure what those are. If we get a chance we'll go and explore those. But check this out guys, this is part of the old runway. I was going to pause the video a sec, it has started to rain. So just let me get my coat and everything zipped up and I'll come back in. See you in a sec guys. Here you go guys, you're back with Southern Urbex. This is what's left of RAF Clavelli. Some of it's boarded off. Well, look at this guys. So I believe the runway is behind us on the main road. I will put a mask on. We'll go in and have a quick look to see what's inside. Let's go and explore, guys. Let's see what's here. Okay, guys, you're back with Southern Urbex. We're just going to go inside this part of what's left of this RAF base in the mid Cheshire. Let's go inside and have a look. The door's open, so it's not secure. Wowzers, you guys. My days. So, first of all, I'm going to stick on my sticker just to say that I've been here. That's just as you're walking. Let's get some light going on, let's have a look. So guys, this is what's left of this part. I am wearing a mask. If it sounds a little bit muffled, that's what you can hear. Um, I've had to wear it just because I think there could be possibly asbestos. Well, let's go and have a bit of a walk through. It's quite derelict. Wow, this is a finished place. Come on, top there. Let's keep walking. Let's have a look. Looks like there's an old fireplace. It looks like that's the manager's office. Tell you what, guys, it's full. Tires. As you can see, it's the manager's office. There's the fireplace. Lots and lots of carpet. I don't know why it's full of carpet as much as what it is. I'm sorry the video is a bit hit and miss, guys. Let's keep having a walk through. Guys, look at this. What a room. Some scary pictures. Someone's old boot. A lot of cobwebs in here. There it is. Let me just get hold of my strap, guys, to see if we can get in. Look at the old boots. That's what's left in here at the minute. Loads of cobwebs. Looks like an old toilet. Oh, the cobwebs though, guys, it's full of them in here. Oh, it's, it's got some age, hasn't it, in here? Where they used to hang bits and bobs, bit of old Daz up there. Let's keep having a walk around, let's see what else is going on in here, guys. Just try to watch my foot in as we go. where they all used to hang out, who knows, there's a bit of an old ironing board there. Flag on the wall. Look at that guys, old pictures. Left on the wall. Oh wow guys, look at this. Oh my word, so someone's old jacket on the wall. The old chairs there. Look at the old typewriter, guys. Let's walk in. Let's 
下がるやろうなって。Finish, fella. Oh, little doll. Left here. English dictionary. Couple of jackets left inside, as you can see. Okay, old tight lighter. That's quite cool. Right, that. Lefty cards, different one bits and bobs. Oh wow, guys, look at this. Same, it's been put through. Someone's old shirt hanging up there. Look at this thing there. Full of spider webs in here as well. Part of the job, unfortunately, in this kind of environment. Look at this there, guys. The old storage there with the candle. Candles there, the candle holders even. Someone's suitcase, I don't think there'll be anything in it, that's all. Nah, it's empty. So this is inside the actual RAF base itself. That's the old picture. So maybe this is just where someone was staying. Someone's old jacket hanging up. There's some uh, jumpers as well there. More clothing. This is the room again that we've just came into. So like I say, I'm not sure what they had this room for. Lots and lots and lots of carpet left. Loads of carpet in here. Couple of old bottles on the side, as you can see. Let's head out though guys, let's go to the rest of the buildings. As I say, this is only one building we've got here. That's the view out the door. Which views onto the car park. In fact guys, let me just get this up at the door. The old keypad on the wall, that's obviously stopped working quite a while ago. Back onto the outskirts again guys, that's the building was in there. If you used to work here, maybe you recognise it, you know what that is. You have to drop any comments guys in inside. This is what's around the side now. Oh, Wardle crash to say, there's stuff all over the place here at the minute. Looks like someone has been fly tipping, which is a shame. That is a real shame, fly tipping. So this is the back of the building, guys. Let's see if I can climb over just to get in a bit more. become a dumping ground so that's the bit of the building we was in see if i can get into any more buildings guys as we go along let's go and have a look inside this one again everything's coming down inside it has just been a dumping ground unfortunately but if any of you recognizes what any of this is guys you'll have to let us know if you've been here before that on the roof it's odd isn't it where's as you guys look at this it's just full of carpet wow so we can climb through without falling we'll have a look at see what else is going on in the building there's a couple of birds living in here now you can see that picture there on the floor. This is in this bit of the room you guys. See the ceiling is partially collapsing in. No toilet. Let's have a look what's in the back of this bit here. Yeah, another old toilet. Yeah, 
go on. I'm sure if you can see it better when I do that. See if that's blown, let's have a look. Ceiling is collapsing in. Not very good on the floor there. You guys look at this. There is stuff. Can you the old fireplace that was there? Another one there as well. Oh wow, these guys, look at that. We'll get into that bit as well. We're gonna have a quick look. So a lot of it's been stripped out guys as you can see. A lot of wires hanging down there. We know all the electrics turned off. Wowzers, well, you guys, look at this place. Yeah, fire. Green floor. So, this is what the officers would have perhaps been resting in after doing whatever they do. Bit of the old drape there. Let's keep going, let's see what else we've got going on. That's where we've just come from. So guys, there's a bit of an attic going up. Wow, just look at this. Wow, this guys, look at this. This is quite something again. what they are, they look like possible candle holders, not sure. The fire exit. Someone's old desk. As you see guys, it's really quiet in here. Something about British hours there. Not sure what they were. Just something else. Someone's stapler left on the table. See guys, just a lot of desolation, but this is what the officers would have used to say, whether this was offices for them or maybe to do with the training or anything like that. So guys, let's go and see what else we've got going on in other buildings. Say this is just one of the buildings. Walk back on the outside again. It's a shame that it's become a dumping ground though. There it is, it's a real shame. The warders, not sure what that was. I think the base, originally when the base closed down, it became little buildings um, where people would have small businesses, I think, at one time. Because it is quite a big site. So I am walking on concrete guys, uh, but it has overgrown with grass. Look at that, little air raid shelter. Wowzers, look at that guys. Let's see if we can walk down and have a look. There's even more air raid shelters over there. So we are right in the heart of the base now. Look at this guys. Probably not bad to have this video going online just so people can see what's left of the airbase before there's not much left because eventually they end up getting knocked down, don't they? Or like this one, just get left to fall apart, which is such a shame. So I think we are on the inside of what would have been the building before it's collapsed and fallen down like this now. Just walk in and see what's left of this bit. To be honest, there's not much left in this. There's a couple of birds in it. That's a real shame. Yeah, the building's collapsed quite a bit. See if we can walk through, see what else is going on there. See, there's always pigeons wherever you go. You always find homes in the abandoned places, don't they? So guys, we're coming back out. That's where we just walked from.
Again, this is inside one of the other buildings. It has cracks, as you can see on the floor. There's an awful lot of rubble on the floor now. Right, that's all just gone. It's interesting when you look at the windows, though. So the windows have got bars on them as well, so I don't know what this would have been used for. Maybe this was an armoury or something, I don't know. So this is the inside of a building, but well, obviously the roof's gone a long time ago. That's where we just was looking through before. Look at that though guys, just pure countryside. So I'm just trying to find my footing through most of this place. I love coming to places like this though. Got a lot of history. An old doorpost there, isn't it? A lot of history to be kept. An old building there. That's the one derelict building, guys. So, we've got a bunker here. The only problem is, I can't really get through it because there's so many. In fact, it's bricked up. So this is one of the air raid shelters that they used to have. That one's been sealed shut completely now. We'll have a quick walk over to the other field. See if we can get across. Just have a quick look at the other air raid shelters. Say there's a couple there in the ground. I don't know if they're going to be open or shut. But it's always worth having a quick look. So guys, this is the air raid shelters. I'm just following someone else's path across to where they've been. This is what's surrounding it. So I don't know if these are open or shut guys, we'll have a look. Hopefully one's open, I don't know if it'll be flooded though, that's the only problem. Lock inside if we can, if it's not flooded, well, it's looking promising. It is open. Oh, guys, so look at this. This is one of the air raid shelters. Torch is on. We'll see if we can get down and have a look. There's a couple of these here, I think there's at least three. I'm not sure if there was any more before that, guys. Walk over to the other one as well. I think the other one's bricked off. I always remember watching a video where one was open and uh, one was sealed as well. Just lifting my mask off just for a little bit, guys. So this is the back of one of the other ones. I think this might be the sealed one, I think, I don't know. Or is this open as well? Oh no, this one's open as well. It was sealed, I think, at one time. It had boards on it. Let's have a look. Oh, wow. Well, this one's completely different. Look at this, guys. Near dripping water. There's a lot of rumination in this one as well. Stood its time though, if you look at it. So they obviously bricked up the end. And this is the view back down. So this is where the wood have ran when the uh, air raid shelter sirens go off. That there's possibly an imminent attack. And this is the steps going up, guys. So you can you imagine clambering down that to get inside? 
when you hear those sirens, the air raid sirens going off, it would have been absolutely scary. Not sure what this was. So I'm walking on top of concrete, so I'm guessing there's something else underneath again. I'm not sure. Guys, I'll start heading back out. There's a couple of buildings at the front. I'll just leave the camera running. It is a longer film, so bear with me. I'm just trying to find my footing to get around all of this. Um, so we're right near a farm. This area shelter, when it shut down, I'm guessing it's on farmland, so it's just stayed with the farm, I think. Um, it's very peaceful here. It's lovely. So the airfield, the actual runway for this, used to be on the main A road that comes into Nantwich, which is where we are currently. I say this is uh, RAF, hopefully I'm saying this right, Clevelly, uh, or Cle Cleveley. It's, uh, it's a lovely place, looking at it. Quite a nice ruin place as well. I like it where they start to dilapidate a bit. Just climbing back under the wire. Give you a quick side view of that. Look at that. So, guys, we'll walk out. Let's have a bit of a walk back down. As you can see, the vehicles used to go up and down here. So, this is concrete that I'm on. It looks green. Got like a green, mossy carpet now. It's a shame what's happened to it, though, how it's been left. So just over the gate, I can see a couple of other buildings, possibly derelict, I'm not sure if they're in use or not. We'll have a quick look, they could be part of what's used for the farm fields, just not sure now. So this is right in the middle of a farmland. One last view guys of everything here. It's nice to see inside where the officers and pilots and different things would have gone you know spent their downtime if you like off the job let's have a quick look over here yeah i can see a couple more buildings i'm not sure what these are we'll have a look it is got a public footpath guys so it's not illegal to be here it's got a right away so you can walk here bit of a trek and it's a bit of a hard one to find if you ever come yourselves but I'd say come it's worth it looking at this wowzers guys I'm gonna pop my mask back up again sorry for the view but I'm not sure if there's asbestos so I've got to be careful my word guys look at this wowzers that's different so again this is I'm guessing this is still part of our way the valley. This is what's left inside. Definite asbestos, I think. So I say we're always being careful. Not sure what this would have been used for though. I know it's got a lot of car bits and bobs in it now. Because I believe to turn these into little workshops after the war. Look at that little chair on the wall there. So I'm not sure what buildings they were originally used for. Maybe these were the, the messes or something, you just don't, don't know, do you? That's just on the side there, guys. A couple more buildings. Look at the old uh, telegraph pole that's fallen, fallen down. Got some size for that. Has. Look at the old gas canister, guys. Almost a full gas canister, I might add. It's quite heavy. Guys, this is another part of it. Wow, so look at that. Isn't it a funny sight seeing buildings that are falling apart as much as this one has? This one's quite a bit of an interesting one. These might have been, I'd say, the engineering workshops, perhaps. I'm just going to hold my mask up one more time, guys, just for while I get close. 
So this is just inside the workshop guys. There's not much to see, so a lot of it's derelict now. So I'm walking, this looks like moss again doesn't it, but it is concrete. There's a couple of buildings over there, but the, it's the same. Quite derelict. There you go guys, this is uh, probably going to be the last shots of RAF Clavelli unless anyone else comes here and videos it and does similar to what I've done today. Um, I hope you've enjoyed the video guys, if you've not subscribed already please do so, uh, it means a lot. Um, tick the notification bell if you want, you'll get to see my videos as they're uploaded, I have got loads to upload. Uh, I do apologise guys, I work for the ambulance service, so I'm in a full time job already, so I'm just trying to fit these in around everything that I'm already doing that's where we've just been that's where you've seen that in fact there's another air raid shelter just at the side of that guys before I do go you can just about make that out I can't get to that one I don't think let's see if we can we're here let's have a look no the fence isn't very stable and I think that's the one that's bricked up anyway that one so I've seen a video of this a couple of years ago now. Yeah, a couple of years old anyway. Um, I'll just show you these. These are the extra bits. So I think those were the workshops from what I understood for the vehicles and anything like that. I don't think the planes were housed there or nothing like that because there's no hangers here now. I think they used to be, but I believe the hangers have all gone. Yeah, so that's just what's left of it now, guys. It's just a lot, a lot, a lot of farmland. So guys hope you've enjoyed it stay tuned uh, subscribe if you will like i say tick the notification bell so you get to see anything new bear with me while i try to upload everything because I, I am in the ambulance service so it's full time already so i'm just trying to do this um on the side really and uh here's the top view of the building sorry it's a bit shaky guys the ground today has been quite unstable out here uh, and inside has been full of all sorts of stuff so i shall leave it with you guys stay safe if you're doing the same if you're watching you're an explorer um stay safe in what you do don't take risks and stuff guys check you later see you later Bye.